Hey, and welcome back to Unqualified Critics. Today I have something I've been waiting on for a couple months now, and that is the TurboGrafx-16 uh, second controller. And you might have two questions if you're looking at this. One, you might say, well, wasn't the TurboGrafx 100 bucks, and why do you need to buy a second controller? That's a good question. And then also, isn't this box labeled PC Engine Mini? Well, they don't make a turbo pad proper. The second controller is console variant agnostic, so this is the generic design that actually doesn't match the design that came with any of the original consoles, the PC Engine Mini, Core Graphics Mini, or Turbo Graphics Mini. So it's just a generic version of it, but it is officially licensed, and it does have the sliders, which if you bought the PC Engine Mini, ironically, that's the one variant that has no slider because originally that console launched with a plain controller, and yet the PC Engine Mini branded second controller which is the only one available has the slider and you can see here this is for all three variants it's manufactured by hori as is the entire original line of consoles now there is a series of region specific controllers made by i think it's 8-bit do a wireless variant and instead of the sliders they have turbo buttons i thought that design was ugly so i skipped it and waited for the real deal and it's here. So let's open this up. Got an off-white beige color. This, let's turn the flash off. So this is an off-white beige color. I can tell you the camera's picking it up as a brighter white than it actually is. You can see there's no PC Engine uh, core graphics or turbo graphics marking. You just get the HE logo. And of course there's no NEC logo, but we already knew that because the controllers that come with the mini console lack an NEC logo. So overall looks just like the turbo pad. For comparison to the turbo pad, here they are side by side. As expected, the shell is identical. Only difference is the color and the labeling on the overlay. I myself am partial to the turbo graphics turbo pad design. Would prefer if they sold me a second one of those. But then at the end of the day, not a big deal. The price on this is $25. With shipping from Amazon US, it's about $33. And this is the first time this is shipping outside of Amazon Japan. So if you want to pick one of these up, that's where you go. Now, I would add the Turbo Graphics, of course, has support for up to five controllers with the multi tap. But it does come out of the box with support for two controllers, which is an improvement from the original Turbo Graphics or PC Engine, which only supported one controller. So now my friend Glenn from Glenn's Retro Show would prefer if it still only had one controller port to keep it authentic. But I think that that's one compromise that was well made. I know I like to play two player. I probably will never need to play more than two. So to have to buy a multi-tab just to play two player would have been kind of lame. So that's it for the Hori Pad, the official second controller for the PC Engine Core Graphics or Turbo Graphics. Check it out. Link below. Thank you for watching.